Today I'm here to tell you why you need to stop Hammer time! Go with the fuck! Obviously not that, right? But this information I'm about to show you will help you know exactly how much you might be able to make with altcoins. Let's check it out. <laughs> What's up guys, my name is Aaron and welcome to Yes Crypto. Hope all of you are doing well out there. So I hear a lot of things in the comments. I see a lot of things in other people's chats and where they basically say, hey, no, I don't think this coin is going to go high. It's only going to do like a 10x. But I just want to put some realistic information out there to show you why maybe you're undervaluing some of these things and understanding what crypto can do. So let me quickly show you that right now. So the first thing we need to actually look at with this is the total cryptocurrency market cap. So this is all the money what flows inside of cryptocurrency and obviously we get the highs from that. So what we are looking to do, we're obviously trying to look, sell near the top, so we're not trying to sell anytime soon. As in, um, and for example, in 2018, so January 2018, that was a top in 2018. And then also obviously our recent one where we went to around about November time um, and that was 2021. First things first, let's get that up on the chart and show you. So look, here we go. So we're looking at 1st of January, 2028. This is a hysterical, historical snapshot and you can see the market cap. So this is back then, we're talking about like, you know, five years ago now, right? And um, I was around in crypto back then. And, uh, and yeah, this is the type of money that was going through it. So we're looking at market caps, right? So Bitcoin had 276 billion inside it. And you can, we can see and keep going down. And what we wanna see is when a billion came in, right? So here you go. So we got to 43, number 43 right here. Um, and then that was where a billion in market cap started to fade off right or what are some of these coins some of these coins yes are known some of them are not even around anymore the point being some of these crap coins are not even around anymore coins were not even that great got to a billion in market cap so 43 coins got into that category so if we now go into the last bull run so we're talking about 14 november and that was like near the highs right in terms of the market cap from what i showed you in 2021 okay and then let's have a look at that so look bitcoin got into a trillion and then all these other ones into billions. So let's go down even further, right? Let's see where the billion stopped. So here you go, 110 coins had a billion market cap. And some of these might have been absolute rubbish again, right? Some of them might have been great. Some of them might have been not very good. Um, so that's what you've got to remember. So you've got 110 right there. So that being said, right? If you have altcoins, which are currently at 1 million market cap, 10 million market cap, and they get to a billion, right? Then Yes, they could actually 1,000x some of them, right? They could 600x, stuff like that. And we're only talking about getting to 1 billion, right? We saw loads of these good coins which have more than 1 billion. Some of them have got to like 22 billion, 100 billion, that type of thing. And if you've got a good project and you think that that project could actually be in the top 10, top 100, then yeah, you could literally look at price predictions like that. And on this channel, this is what we're looking for. We're looking for the gold, which can get into that top 100. And I think that's where I want to put my money. It's up to you what you want to do with yours. But that's the reason I'm showing you these crazy predictions, because that's the vision that I can see for this, right? It's up to you guys what you want to envision it, right? But I just want to put a reality check on it just because a lot of people think that, oh no, that's not going to do very well. This one's only going to go 10x, something like that. No, that you're underselling it, okay? You're underselling This is crypto. This is Sparta! Also, what I just showed you then is the last cycle. As you've seen, I showed you 2018 top and we only got 43 in the billion mark. I showed you 2021 and then we got 110 in there. So what do you think is going to happen the next cycle? The next cycle, we're going to have even more money. You might even see the top 200 now have a billion in market cap. So we're only aiming for the top 200 then. I think that's something you need to weigh into the equation. The more money what comes into crypto, which you see in every single hype cycle, the more money goes into altcoins, the more gains you can make. So in my opinion, don't underestimate the power of crypto and what it can do. Question number one. Don't underestimate the other guy's greed. <laughs> when no one's around and no one's looking, that is when you swoop in. Okay, so also my little words of advice. So I've been in crypto since 2016, seen a lot of highs, a lot of lows. But when one thing I would say to you is when the hype comes in, that's not the time to buy that coin, right? You can look at it, put it on your radar, and then when that price drops, then is the time. So there's a couple of coins I've suggested and the prices are going down. That is the time to execute, okay? <laughs> that is the time to start getting in. When prices are low, I'm not gonna tell you to buy anything high, I'm telling you low. So if you like that 
and if you want to get in at low prices then subscribe if you want to know where a good time to get into altcoins is then check out this video right here and if you want to know any good altcoins that you could get then i've got a whole playlist on that so check out this video right here and if i don't see you i'll see you at the top Bye. <laughs>